Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of Pokemon Reborn Nuzlocke on GameStorm. In the last episode, we made it here to Sephiris, or the top of Sephiris Gym. So now we can actually go, ooh, sorry about that, we can actually go and fight her. So, truthfully, I don't have much of a strategy for this. It mostly just involves Noelle not dying. And after that, frankly, it's I'm flying by the seat of my pants. Um, so yeah, it's basically, I'm just going to boost up with Noelle. Do our usual strategy with them. Store power, move less, etc, etc. Helps that there are fairy types or a drag type moves or stab won't do anything. So yeah, we're just going to go in. And yeah, we're going to pray for the best. Clearly, if this idea doesn't work, we're gonna be up Shit's Creek. I have I have no well up front right yet. Okay. Alright, bought my items on, already double check that. Okay, okay, okay. Whew, whew, whew. Final gym battle, let's go. You do what to clear those theatrics. That's just a formality. Then to put an end to this ridiculous tournament. I convinced Terra to let me use my gym was just a way to make sure I had a favorable field effect to ensure my victory. But in return, if by some fluke you win, you'll have your final gym badge. Consider this a fair exchange. Of course, that's just a formality too, since Lucy's not an option for me. I'll take this tournament for myself. Alright, here we go. Okay. So, it does get a special attack boost, and fi extra firepower, but I think this boosts its flamethrower. Right off the bat, X special defense. Okay, it's fine. Go for two. Okay, and I'm going in a little greedy here. I'm going for the three before I set up the um, lucky chant. Okay, and heal just in case for emergency. I think the ultra potion should be fine. Okay, so now. What I want to do... Oh, wait, now, I do know what I do want to do now. Set up a lucky chant. I almost completely blanked on that bit. Alright. So, we're shielded by those, so I'm not going to... Actually, you know what? Before I even do that... Minimize. Start with these up. Missed, so it's already doing its work. Down. Alright. So now, so my left hand's still up. Throw on some X defense. I am fine with that. Reset the lucky chant. Go all the way for these. Cause, uh, her team, while having a few good special attackers, like this Noiburn, it's actually mostly physical attackers, especially looking at her Dragonite and her Mega, which I won't spoil. Those should be fairly obvious. So, yeah. And I'm actually going to add an X speed onto this. Okay. Make that two. I'm going to use more so that way, if I need to set up a lucky chant, unless they have Dragon Dance, I won't get outsped. That's actually fine. So I'm not gonna. F Actually, yeah, do I will forward store that off because that 
While it doesn't damage me, it will still lower my speed, which is not ideal. The only benefit to that would be if they wanted to toxic me instead. But actually, that's even better, because that doesn't lower your speed, I don't think. Okay, so she's withdrawing. Going with the Charizard. So I'm pretty sure we'll Dragon Dance right off the bat. And while it does that, I'm going to boost up my special attack. Yeah, Mega Evolve. I think Star's right. So I'm going to see if I can knock this thing out in one go with a stored power. She's going greedy. So I think I have a shot to take this thing out in one shot. Okay, good. Salamence now. Moonblast. This thing does have a sash, though. Going for the Earthquake, actually. Okay, Salamence down. Bucket Chance gone. Next up is Haxorus. I wanted to reset that lucky chant. And this is exactly why. So I can't get crit. So I'm going to take the moment and give an extra X special attack. Just to make sure that I take out her dragon when that thing comes out. Because it is a multi scale. So I don't want to take any risks. And we should be faster. And I think this thing has a sash too, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah. Well, so this gives me a good time to heal while my lucky chant is still up. And the fact that I'm still faster than it. That's actually fine, because that does nothing against us. So that just stops us from getting burned later or something like that, because... Thanks to Magic Guard, I think it's Magic Guard, we take no damage from anything outside of direct damage. Okay, Lucky Chain's gone. There's the Dragonite. I'm gonna risk it and go for Store Power. Okay. Oh, it lives. It still misses. Garchomp. Let's go store power. Done. Now it's just the Noivern. We come full circle. No, we're not switching. Keeper Sephira. Really? Losing is not an option. I have a family to look after. It's been my responsibility ever since our parents. Actually, that's not right. Even an orphan should have had a different guardian. But I didn't. I was forced to learn several things about the world. Everyone is corrupt. No one is on your side. No one's going to listen. And funny, isn't it, that all you do is sit there and listen. You play God like some kind of doll with a power you have no right having. And just watch it happen. Do you think you can solve any problem just by being able to defeat whatever team of Pokemon gets thrown at you? That's kind of how this world works. If you could, something would be wrong. Maybe that's the case. Everything's wrong. The doctor is dead. So you say. And just what the hell do you think that leads me to do now? Protect my sisters? Let's be honest, I've just been using them. It was the only way I could even convince myself to move forward. In the end, he was always my focus. So should I be happy that the thing I've been chasing this whole time is gone? I didn't want him dead. I wanted to kill him myself. 
I wanted to find take back the control I lost so long ago. So that maybe, just maybe, I could possibly begin to convince myself that I have an inkling of power. Even if it's just enough to keep myself safe. Because I know that I don't. I can't. Lin, having done that, just proves it. That we are in this tournament. In this city. That I did lose here. In the end, I know I'm helpless. Just like back then. I couldn't stop him. No one believed me. Not even he remembers it. He's in a stupor, some kind of trance. He's been saying it over and over. Lizzie, Lizzie, Lizzie. Back and forth, back and forth. Crying the entire time. Over and over. What seemed like forever. There's nothing left for me to do about it now. If I do get out of here. Your badge and team are in the chest below. Tara, you're still listening, right? I'm ready. Just put me down already. It's time to sleep. Well, that's that. Let's go get my final badge. Frankly, I don't care for Saphira. She's honestly kind of an asshole, and I do not have much patience for that. So, I... Like, the others I felt bad for, I don't really feel bad on this one. Because Saphira kind of had a comeuppance coming. Like, she was being a little bit too much of an asshole. So... Alright, we get the treasure badge. Our final reborn gym badge. And Team 2 Dragon Claw. Alright. So let's hop out of here. And there is another battle coming that I have to go to a PC for. And maybe we can get to a PC before it happens. Oof. Okay. What the fuck? Hey, Florania. You doing okay, buddy? I'm skipping Tara because I don't like her. So, fuck you, Tara. Yeah, I'm not even giving Tara the light of day anymore because she is just. She has pushed me over the limit too many times with her dialogue. And also because this fight that I'm about to do. Which, spoiler, is against Terra. It's kind of bullshit. So, the gimmick is, so it's basically like fighting Terra before, like, you're in the glitch field. Uh, she does have a different team, which is, frankly, a lot tougher than her gym team. Not gonna lie there. It's kind of Mimi, too. With a certain Pokemon. Um, but, here's the real rub with her team. Um. Like, this battle... She removes all text, so you cannot see what your items are, so you need to know your item list by heart. You can't see what your moves are, so you have to know what those are by heart. And you can't see specific numbers, so you have to just kind of guess, just based on the color. So, first things first, I am going to... No, not my... I want to go to my PC here. Deposit some items. I'm going to pause you, pause you, pause you two. Anything that I'm not going to be needing in this battle is getting deposited. Although the only thing I'm really going to be using, so like the berries, stuff like that, that's not going to come into play. So, those are fine. Uh, do I want to keep dire hits? Because that could be very useful in a couple of scenarios. Yeah, I think I'm going to keep Dire Hits. I'm going to put Guard Specs in. Okay. So, now my list of items is significantly reduced, but I should still have enough of each to do what I need to do. Um, question is on who I want to do what on the team. Because her team is like a mix of her old gym team and a new one. I think I'm going to put Jacqueline in the front. Because it can handle a couple threats on our team. So one thing, her first Pokemon is going to be uh, Sword Stance, Life Orb, Exodrill. Not really much of my team that can 100% deal with that. But it doesn't have any moves. So it only has one move that's neutral. The rest are not very effective against Jacqueline. So yeah, it's going to hurt. But I think Jacqueline can live it. So if by chance something happens where it decides to do something, I can set up, get ready for the rest of her team. Uh, 
I need a Will-O-Wisp that Jacqueline Shade has. Frankly, Jacqueline's better for this overall battle. Uh, to deal with her Dawn Fan, which is kind of BS. It's only level 1. Uh, and it has a Shell Bell. It's a mix of the moves Ice Shard and Endeavor. Which is the memeiest move set they could have put on this game. Because basically, if you don't have a Pokemon that has uh, either a double hit move or really strong priority in extreme speed or a status, you can't really beat that Dawn fan. And then she also has an Eevee Light Chansey with, again, based on Gen 1 mechanics, it's fucking busted. Because, again, special. Whichever is higher between special attack or special defense becomes the stat for both in the glitch field. So, Chansey has bonkers special attack because of that. But then it also gets the Eevee Light boost too, which. Oh god, that is so messed up that they put that in there. That. If that existed in actual competitive Pokemon, Chansey would be. Not even. It would be. Like, Cloud Band from Ubers, I bet. This is based on how busted that would be in general mechanics. Then her Quagsire was, was from her gym. That thing's gonna be very difficult to take down. Uh, just because it is so, so bulky. Which is kind of why I want to keep the dire hits. Because crits are gonna be like a unnecessary thing for that. Next up is her Porygon Z. That's gonna be another tough one. Because it has Gomerlion Z, which is gonna use for its conversion, which boosts all of its stats. Um, plus adaptability, uh, and then guard jump and then salt vest. Yeah, this is gonna be a rough battle. This is gonna be a really rough one. So yeah, that's I I have no other way that I can prepare for this at this point. So we just have to go in and pray, basically. Please hold. I'm not even doing. I'm not doing Terra's dialogue. Fuck Terra. Terminal accessed. I'm not even. I I I've had it with Terra, honestly. Please allow me to explain. First, a synopsis of the situation for GameStrong. This building numbers among one of the first structural experiments in digital architecture. Whereas traditional architecture can be likened in, to a painting on a canvas. Digital architecture is more similar to writing on a dry erase board. State of the art three dimensional holograms comprise the entirety of the inside of the building. And tactile senses are created and maintained via high precision localized changes in air pressure. In this way, a building can be remodeled or reorganized on effective impulse, not just similar to the concept of Soji in some Eastern style houses. In this way, also a host is able to customize visual input per participant to ensure correct pathing among larger groups of individuals. Or, for instance, create and remove entrances at will. Control of visual data along the high intensity air pressure is also sufficient to stimulate what the aforementioned individual referred to as deletion. In reality, no harm befalls the individual, but the capacity to move and speak is directly impeded by the digital controls. Visual data can then be arbitrarily displayed to suggest a desired effect. Since the flow of air and data is ultimately digitally regulated, it can be influenced in a way that not unlike any typical computer. As the speaker had begun to say after the conclusion of the last match, an application was made accessible to me through an emergency terminal. It was assumed to be by someone's design. After several attempts, I was able to install a program to the system. This program's function was to, after a certain amount of time had passed, refer any sensor to a deletion that might be applied to the person. In summary, no matter how much you attempt to pressurize or delete me, it will be automatically undone each time. After this is a sufficient explanation. Again, Skippy Terra, be my guest. Sorry, Terra, no. In addition to a program to counteract suit deletion, a second program has been written to restore the first to the cease function. Not incorrect. I was not idle during the time I was pretending to still be incapacitated. I will be requiring your assistance shortly. First, I am constructing an avatar for her based on her foreign data. When it's complete, I will need you to. It 
it would appear your search was uncomprehensive. Next, I'll duplicate the protection applied to this individual for you and rendering you immune to suit deletion. This will only take a moment. Nope. Sorry, Tara, not happening. Objective nearly complete. Beginning avatar deployment. What? I'll do it now that she's a real girl. Oh shit, I'm a real girl now. The successful outcome of this trial indicates that you must have been a real girl previously as well. Oh sweet cakes, I can jack off again. The credibility of that statement best remains untested. That's not the purpose for which this avatar has been created. There's even a couch here. Girl, you might. Thanks, you will need to distract her while I make the final adjustments to the system. It's critical that you maintain her attention. Uh, better idea. How's about? I should delete them instead. Gablammy! Masaka? The protection applied to this individual has already been extended to include GameStrom. Should the deletion will remain an ineffective strategy in this scenario. Noni? You even shared that with GameStrom? I'm not saying that one. GameStrom, if you are prepared. How's the nine? No one ready. I may not be able to delete you, but what will you do when I delete your fonts? I did my research, Tara. So screw you. Do I want to will us? Do I want to ex-defend first? I think my best best to ex-defend first. If it goes for, say, uh, like a sword stance, then I'll will a wisp it. But, yeah, I think so that's ex-defend there. I took pictures and notes to determine which one's which. You know what, actually in the moment, I'm just gonna mash it one for one. Okay, it must have missed doing whatever it's doing. So I'm gonna take the moment and I'm gonna go for a third. I don't know what it, it must have missed rock side or something. Okay, now I'm gonna do the will o -Wisp. There we go. So now its attack gets halved, I believe, and it can't boost it anymore. So I'm gonna boost my X special defense, which I believe is this one. Yes. We'll see how much she does. Okay, that doesn't do nearly as much as I was fearing, so that's fine. This is more of a protection against uh, later points in the battle. Okay, so now I don't have a choice, but I have to heal. Okay, so... I think an Ultra Potion should suffice in this scenario. Okay, that's fine. Okay, so one more X special defense should do fine. So I'm plus three on my special D. The next thing that I'm gonna do is I'm going to boost up my physical attack. So let's go with another ultra potion. Because this thing's just gonna kill itself eventually. Yeah. So I think the red one is. Okay. 
Okay, so his burn's gonna take it down. Let's stay in. Okay, Chansey's coming out right now. I'm going to... I'm actually just gonna forward store just in case it's not taking me up to full. This way I at least know. Okay, so we have plus six. So what I'm actually gonna do, just in prep for that, um, for the Quagsire, is I am, so I need to go one, two, three. That's Dire Hit. I don't not like this. But we're stored just in case of emergency. Of course. But that's at this point, this I'm still boosting. So now, just to make sure I outspeed this thing when I decide to attack, I'm gonna go for an X speed. It's not going to help me too much in the later parts of the fight, but should still give me an edge against this Chansey. Okay. And also, having higher speed will actually allow me a better chance to crit. Can you miss? It is 90 accurate. <sighs> okay. Psychic, okay. Maybe right now blizzards. I might be allowing myself to a false insecurity with that one. So I think blizzard only has 8 PP to it. So I'm getting a little low. I'm gonna take the moment, heal up. You know what, since I'm doing this, I'm just gonna boost up to plus six speed too. I have no reason not to at this point. That's only gonna help me at this point. So you have plus six in every stack except for special attack. Which in this circumstance doesn't matter. That lowered down my special defense by one. But act actually at this point, screw it. Going all in. This should knock it out. Yeah. Heals me back up to full. Great. Sticking in. Oh, okay. It's this thing. So I'm gonna actually just take this moment because it's not doing jack shit to me in terms of damage. Go to these. And I'm going to re increase my lowered special defense. this. Oh, okay, so we get a free hit in on this thing then. That increases that a little bit. Go for it again. Okay, one of the big threats on our team is down. Stay in. Okay, so what does this Garchomp have? Okay, so it does have Flamethrower. But in this circumstance, I'm not particularly worried. Okay. 
That's its rough skin. Oh, Draco Meteor. Okay. Yeah, I'll take a little bit back from its rough skin. That's fine. Okay. So, another one down. Level up. No switchy. You can do that all you want. That doesn't help you. Now it's just a Porygon, I believe. And it has to use its Z-move here, otherwise it dies. It dies anyways. Oh, Jacqueline, my goddess. Okay. Screw you, Terra. Our old data restored. That was ample time, GameStrong. You have my gratitude. Hey, is this really what you meant to happen? Correct. Beckman is saying all this up. Seemed fun. This is really what you had in mind for me. This was the expected outcome. Oi, bitch, shut up. I know you won't respond. You don't even smile. Neither does the other one. You used to laugh so much. Hey. Could it be that you're still laughing out wherever you are? Or did you stop and that's why this is happening? I really hope even if it was just a tiny bit. They was able to make your game better. So, don't forget me. Okay. Oh no, I will forget you immediately. You do not deserve anything from me. She chose to delete herself. My configuration would have annulled her digital controls and frozen her avatar, but not removed her outright. Given that, unlike us, she was solely digitized entity, it is a genuine deletion. This outcome was not foreseen. Nevertheless, her determination that I would take only the most predictable actions led to her undoing. It's true that I do deliver I deliberately placed several relevant files and locations that would have led her to that conclusion, but a separate program randomized the location of other components. Inclusion, she failed to account for the randomness she seemed to treasure so much. The next process has been completed. I've created a direct route for you to exit this place. In the meantime, I will remain here and restore the capacity of the other tournament participants from suit to deletion. They will surely catch up to you as they are able, but may take additional time for me to route passages forward for those who lost in the earlier rounds. The remainder of Team Meter have only skipped north into Victory Road. I suspect I do not need to instruct you the procedure from here on out. Remain as vigilant and effective as you always have. Farewell, and good luck. So where's my exit? Is it down here? Florania? Swear to God, Florania. Okay, the hell. It. What the frick? I'm getting so confused. I thought I was supposed to have an exit. Florania, where is my exit? Okay, you said that you have an exit for me. Where is the exit? Oh. Why can I not move? Oh, okay. Wait, I don't know about you, do I? Stand down. I said. It is over. No, the other said. They turned Traitor's tail into that secret mine. Our purpose is bastardized. They speak only of what they gained from the Blaster's notion of the new world. Where is our family? I turned my back to my allies so that I might have dealt with you. And next I knew there was a knife in it.
What? Oh my god. I was gonna say, this is it. there's nothing to guide about this. Even those from within the team itself. Too little, too late. What manner of devil are you that neither tooth nor nail may stay your cantankerous blight? I am inevitability. None of us made to interfere. Life does not wait around for permission, girl. Neither does death. Your treason is not gonna notice. Your com comeuppance will not be forgotten. Incorrect. Cry and protest all you want. I will show you how little you understand. Shit, okay, Solaris. Hmm. So, can I go back? Or do I have to, like, go... Oh shit. Okay. Oh, there's Pokemon Center here, so I can fly around. Okay. I was gonna say, because I want to fly back to Reborn City and, like, get supplies and stuff. Okay, what's the job? Okay, so be a litter? Nah. My job is spirit hunting. The place has a share of ghost in it. Exactly ghost in traditional sense. More like after images. Remnants of the former champions who once roamed those halls. Oh god. For the decades ago or so recently you could pass them on the street. Who knows why it's happened. Beyond something or other of the crystals in there reflecting their presence of power through light. Breaking some problem. See, odd cave. If we road for former champions, for the pun, but she's out of my league. Four Pokemon are tough enough, but all together it's a level I just can't compete on. I need your help. If you're strolling on in, they're as calm as you seem to be. I wonder which you deal with those guys. I've already done my part stabilizing the spirit's presence. All you do is find us to do them, reduce me to battle, and then free them. Okay? Okay. Give me a little nudge at the end. Spirits from room with you. Spirit tracker. Okay, what do I get for killing all the spirits? Destroy the environment around them. Task is it. Okay, I want to know what the prize is before I actually decide to do that. Now, what do I got here? Oh, just basic items. Okay. Oh. Oh shit, okay, Victor Road's right there. I figured it would be. You know what? Screw it. Let's go get our Victor Road encounter. We got Jacqueline up front. So, yeah. Oh! So we already got a glimpse of this uh, in Terra's Digital World. I'm guessing that was the thing telling us there's a spirit around. Where are the wild Pokemon? What is my Victor Road encounter? Come on. No Pokemon in here somewhere. I'm not going up there because I know that triggers a cutscene. I don't have a repel on or anything. Where are the wild Pokemon? Hello? Wild Pokemon! Wait, I think I hear Kingdom Hearts music. Wait, I think this is Sanctuary. Or at least a remix of it or something. Something close. It sounds just like Sanctuary. Okay. We have an item. Where are the wild Pokemon, though? Are 
Are there not wild Pokemon in here? I could have sworn the guy said there's wild Pokemon. Do I have to go deeper to find them? Jameson, look out! What the? Alright. Thanks, I learned from you. I'm sure trying to keep your brass mouth shut. Start focusing on your own task. Hm. Hey, zipper lips. I know you think you're real cool around making this far, but newsflash. The only people you've had to face so far have been the team's gutter trash. Zero was already fired. That terror girl was a joke in the first place, and Doctor had less spine than most Ekans do. Even being gutter trash is a fluke. Gameshow couldn't skill himself out of wet paper back. Neither could you, Fern. You had to team up with Team Mir to even make it to Victory Road. How's that feel? You couldn't even complete the gym challenge. Unlike me, look at all 18 badges. Oh wait, you can't. There's no way up here. Lin set us up in this nest to make sure you didn't get any further. Good luck finding a way up that doesn't exist. In the meantime... Here's an ice cold crash. Oh, hey Sephira. Now I'm my Raj. Oh look, an entourage of Deus Ex Friendship uh, shows up out of nowhere as always. It's the only way Gameson survives. Hey, wasn't Digit- Oh, Digitid supposed to make sure only one got through? She was, but the result is clear. Find a way to fix it. I'm taking the girl and going ahead. Ow, stop that already! Ugh! There's nowhere even to go. Well, that's their problem, not ours right now. Gonna help out or what? Game some isn't worth the energy. Neither are you, Fern. This is a convenient excuse. What'd you just say? Couldn't hear me over the sound of your own ego? Couldn't hear over the sound of how pathetic Game Stream is. It's really deafening. Ooh, sick burn, Fern. You can do with this on your own. I'm out of here, too. Later, losers. The sorry state when I, of all people, am the only one pulling the weight. Man, I was just in front just in this for a free ride. Now it's the shit show. Whatever. Games man, whoever you are, of the lady. Turn all you want, but the storm isn't stopping. Gameson, you find a way around to deal with it. The golden marks on the floor will show you the main path forward, all the way to the northeastern exit. I'll draw its attention so you can move more freely. But be on guard in case he doesn't notice you. Heroes won't be far behind. The running is far too fast. Oh, and thanks for shutting that girl back down. Sh oh, shutting that girl down back there. Okay. I'm just looking for my wild Pokemon encounter. That's all I'm looking for. So I'm guessing that's a alarm for- Oh, that's- Oh, that's what spirit looks like. Okay. So... Does the wild Pokemon not come out, or... There has to be wild Pokemon here, right? It's Victory Road. Like, I don't want to run around here for hours, but, like, it's literally the last... Oh, okay. So he is just going to keep firing on you. Okay, so I'm gonna... I'll just do this in the next episode, because... Yeah, there's, there's no Pokemon appearing. So, like, yeah. And this is still Labrador City, so I don't know. It's not make a whole lot of sense to me. But whatever the case, thank you everyone so much for watching. I will see you guys in the next Pokemon Reborn Nuzlocke. Catch you later.